Welcome to the world of iToy from Sony. Now you're probably raring to get going with it, but if you haven't played games using iToy before, there are just a few things you'll need to know to help you get the most fun out of it. It's really very simple. The only other things you'll need are a PS2, a TV, and, um, uh, well, a player. Ah, yes, you'll do fine. Now, first, plug the camera into either of the two USB ports on your PS2 console. Then, place the camera in the middle of your TV, either below or immediately above it. Um, it's just stand back one and a half to two meters. That's better. You need to make sure your image is in the center of the screen. If it is not, gently tilt the camera up or down until it is. There's no need to move the whole camera. If you're a little blurry, you can adjust the focus by rotating the dial on the camera. Now, most important, you must stand out clearly on the screen. So arrange the lighting so you're not too bright or too dark. But don't worry, a red light on the camera will come on if you are too dark. So just make yourself a little brighter. And now, you're ready to play. There is no handset in iToy. You are the controls. That's right, just move your arms, your head, or any part of your body. But obviously, make sure you have enough room to play. Now, if you should need to stop the game, just place your hand right in front of the camera. And one last thing. You can, of course, cheat by moving your whole body close to the camera. But where is the fun in that? Now... Have fun playing iToy. Goodbye. <laughs>